Night. A wild night in the parking lot of an East Greenbush apartment complex. Good evening, I'm Greg Floyd. And I'm Dory Marlin. What began with an annoying driver waking up the neighborhood really turned into something that was like a scene straight out of a movie. The man recovering after police say he was hit and run over by that driver is speaking out tonight. Jennifer Lukey is in East Greenbush and she has this evening's top story. Witnesses say the suspect was in his car and he just kept doing donuts around this part of the parking lot over and over again, peeling his tires, beeping his horn, making a lot of commotion. Two brothers who live here came down and approached the car to see what was going on. Russell tried to stand in front of the car so that he couldn't leave and Dan tried to hold on to the car. Well, the guy just floored it. He hit the gas and he like flipped up on the car not to get killed. It was like from a movie. I decided at first I'll stand in the way and try and stop him. But then when I seen Russell on the hood, I was like, oh no, he's just going to hit me too and I'm going to join Russell on the hood. So I backed up. Multiple people called 911 when a police cruiser responded. 18 year old Logan Marshner, the driver, allegedly slammed on the brakes, throwing Russell off the car. Then police say Marshner drove forward over Russell's legs. It was senseless. It was senseless. Russell was taken to the hospital. We caught up with him shortly after he was released today. What do you remember about it? Not much, to tell you the truth. Mm. You remember being on the hood of the car? No. No. You remember getting hit after you fell off? No. No. I remember getting in an ambulance. He's got broken ribs, a leg injury, and a lot of bumps and bruises, but he's trying to remain positive. Do you it could have been worse. We have kids that are out here riding their bikes and people walking their dogs and people would have got killed. The suspect was arraigned this morning, held on $25,000 bail. He is expected back in court later this month. In East Greenbush, Jennifer Lukey, CBS 6 News.